missile crisis came, my father spent most of the 13 days in the White House. And he said that we had to be good soldiers and show up at school, that if there was a nuclear war, that none of us would want to be around afterwards. Each small mistake could bring us to the confrontation. As my father repeated, if we lose control, we'll not be in church. Dad virtually told me nothing about Cuba. When Castro came in to overthrow Batista, my father must have been pretty thrilled, actually. You know, because he could remember Batista was not such a great guy. We've been lied to since, since 1959 about Cuba, and we're still being lied to today. This unholy alliance between Nixon, the mafia, and the CIA still impacting us today. At no time has the CIA engaged in any political activity that was not approved at the highest level. We made it United States policy to assassinate Fidel Castro. Wow, this is not what we bargained for. We just thought we were going to get rid of a corrupt government. <laughs> President held out an olive leaf to Castro and he said to him, the United States history in Cuba has been a history of atrocities. And we understand that we're gonna have to pay for that in one way or another. 